Hey guys, it's OKB, and I'm here with probably the craziest Fuku deals you will ever see. Well, no, that's not right. The craziest Fuku deals so far. It's not going to be the craziest. Coupons have been easier to get. You know, Mokubu trials have extra coupons and all that stuff. But like 60,000 is just... How long did I have to save up for this? And I didn't even do this as like completely free to play. As a free to play, it's really hard to save up 60,000, but if you did, congratulations, you are amazing. Uh, for people who don't, well, <laughs> I mean, this is 60,000. Look, the, the easiest way to get coupons, guys, is just to go to Benefit Hall, um, get Platinum Monthly Cards and Monthly Cards, and yes, it costs ingots, but, you know, I have a channel, Coffin Swag, you guys can check it in the descriptions of this video right now, um, that will teach you how to get ingots over a month or so, you know, that's... Ingots is basically the best method to get coupons. That's unfortunately the truth, right? It's, it's a 600% rebate on ingots over coupons. That alone should tell you something. And that's on platinum monthly cards and monthly cards. And most people can only afford that much anyways. So, you know, this is... Ingots are the the jam, the shit. I'm, not, I'm, gonna, I'm trying not to curse either. Nautilus Froggy is also way a couple hundred percent rebates, and then Milky Boo Trials, extra Milky Boo Trials, like all of that put together, you, you, you will, there's going to be enough stuff to spend ingots on with like a couple hundred percent rebates, so if you guys are like, I can't do this Fuku deals, uh, well, you know, just do your best to try to get it as a free-to-play, or you can go outside of that um, and try to get some ingots. But yeah, aside from that, this is also a 30,000 Fuku deals um, because there's basically two sections to this, uh, 60,000 and 30,000. And the 30,000 is a six pass Nardo or a Katsu Christian Kakuzu. If you already have six pass Nardo, some people have them, or Battle Power Pack 3, um, 60,000 is Reserve Soul Tsunade or a Fukuromo Power Pack times one, which is probably pretty good. I don't really care what's in it. Um, I actually don't know what's in it right now, but it is going to be worth it because it's in the highest range. Okay, uh, and before I forget, I am with the Coffin community right now. It's actually quite a few people, so let me switch over uh, to Discord. Everyone say hi. It's a whole bunch of people here. They're not voice chatting, probably. I mean, someone might randomly come in and voice chat, but, you know, once in a while, I'll do a flash stream, and you guys can come join me and, you know, listen to me, talk to me. Sometimes you can ping me if it's related, um, like a question that you might have, some other people might have, so on and so forth. I do these once in a while, sometimes a lot, sometimes very little. It depends on the season, you know, especially during Fuku deals, we get to really get into it. So, the link's in the description to that if you want to join us, all right? Um, now let's get back to this. Fuku deals. Let's, I'm going to go over more details on the Fuku deals for now. Uh, as you go up, the rebate amount goes up. Uh, let's see, for the small amounts, I would say 5,000 is, like, even 5,000 is actually not too bad either, um, if you don't have much. 10,000 is always nice. There's always a battle power pack if you don't like the ninja. So, honestly, the more you can spend, the higher your rebate is going to be, just in general, overall. And I think the items here are all pretty good. I haven't seen a bad item yet so far. Um, Inman Skill Tri Packs I kind of need. Not my favorite, but that's about it. I don't think ref refines battle power packs, which might, which is you know choosy. Uh, if you can, if you you can get either training potions or refines, um, I think just that's pro one of them is going to be in battle power packs. I think uh, I don't think there's one that doesn't have that. You or, or I guess secret skulls too, but those are okay. You have an ultimate treasure essence at thirty thousand, which is pretty typical. Um, th now this is not as good as let's say uh, thirty thousand Fuku deals, uh, where there were on there's only thirty thousand. All right. So if you have 30,000 and you're planning on spending another 30,000 Fuku deals and you're looking for value, this might actually not be your little thing here. Um, it, it, yeah, it really might not be because they have, they would have a, what, like a huge ninja assist pack or something like that at the end of the, the top reward of a Fuku deal. So maybe you might want to stay away from 30,000 if you are planning to, you know, they're still going to make 30,000 Fuku deals, all right? It's not always going to be 60,000. Like, it's, they might do it a couple times, but, like, no, I'm pretty sure they're not going to do 60,000 every single time. And if they do, then it's, that's just stupid. That's way too much. Um, but, yeah, at 30,000, I actually might wait if you want to wait for it. 
Forty thousand is okay, actually. Uh, this all all pretty typical, very good, nothing bad. Cave key is probably the worst item there, which is not too bad because you can use that to get an ultimate treasure essence. So you know that's nice too. Fifty thousand has ultimate treasure essence again. I like that. Cave keys again. Magatama. Okay, that's where I start to draw the lines. So I'll take forty thousand over fifty thousand already. Uh, thanks to that Magatama. Two Magatamas, yeah, no, no, no. Um, the Cave Key is the worst item on the 40,000. Magatamas is even worse, uh, in my opinion. I'm not sure in a new server, I guess. And then an Ultimate Treasure Essence, well, uh, hmm. Yeah, Ultimate Treasure Essence is on 30,000, though, as well. I'm not sure about getting the middle of the road rewards here, okay? The thing is that Reserve Soul Tsunade is such a good ninja that I. Like the bad power items or the slightly worse power items is covered absolutely by Reserve Cell Tsunade because Tsunade is just that good. It op She opens another level, that another dimension of play in Nardo Online. It's kind of crazy. It's it's kind of amazing that they're putting it out here. Um, I know it's in the 50, 40, 50, 60,000 range, but still, it's free to play now. Um, you just had to pay really patient. And, you know... Man, I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised. You know, there's two shocks, six fast Naruto breakthroughs, which we're still exploring, and then uh, Reserve Soul Tsunade. Now, for the people who are wondering if Kasuke Creation Kakazu is worth it, yes, he is. I'm actually thinking about using him with six fast Naruto, simply because, you know, six fast Naruto uses a lot of ninjutsu. Um, Kasuke Creation Kakazu increases resistance and ninjutsu, and um, removing buffs is kind of nice, too. And, it, like, this revival skill, it's... It's kind of perfect because Six Pass Naruto can be a one-man army. And Akatsuki Creation Kakazu is, well, it buffs that one-man army and summons a whole bunch of support um, back to life over and over again, which might support your one-man army by debuffing the, your opponent or something like that. So all the ninjas in here are worth it. And if you don't like it, there's always a battle power pack, which is worth it. 60,000 is probably the best rebate you're ever going to see at the moment. Um, compared to any Fuku on any Fuku we've ever had simply because that's the nature of Fuku deals the more you spend the higher the rebate value gets I don't even need to look at I don't even need to calculate it to know this okay uh, oh, once again the last power items is ultimate treasure essence so this is something you would see in the 30,000 um, Fuku deals when there's when there's not like 40 50 60,000 that's why that's why I'm saying the 30,000 you might actually want to wait a little bit um, for like a deluxe assist pack, which they'll give at a 30,000 rate, but you know, it's not bad. Um, I, in terms of power items, I think I'm getting kind of disappointed as we go to 40, 50, and 60,000. Um, so if you're doing this for power, I, I'm not sure I would suggest it that much. It kind of, like, it's kind of covered by the ninja, so as, as long as you like the ninja, it's fine. If you don't, you, we're gonna have to figure out what that Fukuroma power pack one is supposed to be. Um, yeah, in terms of power items, maybe in terms of value of power items, it might be huge. But at the same time, this is actually a little disappointing to have cave keys on that one. Secret skulls is okay. Deluxe assist, I, I, 500 training potions is not bad though. Yeah, I mean, this is fine. As long as this is covered. Okay, that's Huku deals for you. Um, I'm actually surprised I anal analyzed that 30,000. You might actually want to wait on 30,000. Okay, uh, the rest of the events, Infinite Tsukiyomi is just out. I don't really need to go over that. It is what it is. Shinobi Feast, is it worth it? It kind of, it's, it's, it's okay. Um, Talking Karen, Susana Shisui. Uh, I, I, I forgot about Susana Shisui, which is in Wheel of Fortune, which I'll, we'll discuss later. But um, I don't know if he's a counter, like a potential counter to Six Pass Naruto because he can stop the mystery cooldown and stuff. But uh We'll, we'll see. Maybe for the first two rounds it'll work, but past that, probably not. Okay, Shinobi Feast, one, Ronin, Zabuza, is he that good? I have one guy, I think. I don't know if he's still in the Discord chat right now, but, uh, huh. Regular CPL? Okay. CPL is offering to fight uh, me in probably Arena with the Consecration Kakuz and Six Pass once we get that. So we'll get there. We'll get there. Um, but yeah, I think that should be pretty good. I'm, I was also trying to, I think Akatsu Creation Kakuzu can be used in a team to fight against Six Fast Naruto, um, but it can't do it alone. It's just like a 
potential. Like when you put it in a perfect team with like to fight against Six Fast Naruto, it will be helpful because Six Fast Naruto increases Ninjutsu and uh, Katsuki Christian Kakuzu increases resistance. So they fit together. Okay, but Shinobi Feast is okay. It's kind of decent. Um, if you like Susanoo Shisui, Tentil's Monarch is kind of nice. Obito is going to get breakthroughs. I mean, it's it's all it's not bad at all. That Ronin Zabuza though, I'm not really sure how good he is. That mist effect is so weird. I, I just I can't even remember it because it's it's just different. Uh, well, I guess that's this is where they got the a thousand ingots for moderate Tentil's moderate fragments is from. I guess I missed out on the soccer gift thing, for sure. But I don't know, man. We'll see. Um, I, I guess I didn't miss out because I'm get I get to do this sixty thousand Fuku, and then make sure to do arena training. You know, flower events. You know what? I have to go to uh, forums Naruto Online to kind of look at what's in the, you know, flower event today. Um, I actually don't remember what it is. Oh wait, no, it's finished. Right? This is this is last week. Okay, this is last week. My bad. Uh, but yeah. You know, dude, you know, Flower is always a nice event to spend stamina on, but there's always a spender there, no matter what. Instance is recharge rebate. So, in terms of recharge, if you guys are small rechargers and like me, like I'm gonna do Benefit Hall. Um, in Benefit Hall, I'm gonna recharge Platinum Monthly Card and Monthly Card, which adds up to like 900 ingots. But if you want to do the recharge rebates and stuff, it should be about a thousand. And so, seven days of welfare is gonna have a 500 recharge. Um, each day, which is nice. This is actually worth more than 2,000 ingot recharge, which is just stupid. Um, training potions are better than the seal scroll, and the coupons are better than the milkaboos. This is kind of ridiculous. This is worth less than 50 either. The, yeah, you know, I don't know if it's true of every single one, but just do the 500 each time. Like, the 2,000 kind of sucks. Um, and then Fuku deals, I, we just talked about. Colored banners from last week. Total spending rebate. So, for spenders, this is actually, if you have 60,000 coupons, then this is actually an 85,000 total rebate for you. Uh, <laughs> I know it's ridiculous, but you can spend it up to 85,000 and get a pretty good rebate out of it. Um, they're, they're getting like Anko, Swimsuit Anko. I forgot how she was, but she wasn't that great. She was just like a collector ninja. But you can also get a battle power pack so for power, I guess, so... Um, it's okay. This is like a bonus. I wouldn't say this is the best spending rebate for people who are actually spending. Um, and I think people who spend actually know this already, so I'm not going to go over it too much. Fateful choice. Uh, yeah, this is where I'm going to get my extra six pass Naruto fragments. I like that Conan's here. I wish I was able to get Conan earlier, but then now six pass Naruto is out and I have to use that. So, yeah, it is what it is. Uh, I might... Thinking about using this with like running on Sasuke, it's kind of hard to say. Like Great Ninja and Madara is a good one to use this with. Um, Great Ninja and Madara versus Six Fast Naruto. That actually is something I would consider uh, because Great Ninja and Madara doesn't need to use this mystery all the time, and you can just not use your mystery, and then Six Fast Naruto won't get his extra mystery, or uh, I mean extra standard attack. Um, and Great Ninja and Madara's mystery won't even hit Six Fast Naruto, but Six Fast Naruto's standard won't hit. Madara, which is a weird thing to think about. We'll see who wins. Shields versus healing, you know? Um, yeah, it'll be kind of interesting, because once everyone's dead on Great Ninja's Madara's side, ah, I don't know. Well, that's why we have Revival Ninjas. Makes things more interesting. But yeah, this this is where we're going to get Six Pass Naruto. I don't see. I don't think there's any other event this week to get Six Pass Naruto. There might be next week, but you don't count on it. It doesn't always work. Uh, there's more people on Dune Rinnegan really on Sasuke now, which is interesting for my server. Maybe they want the fear on Sasuke or, uh, yeah, because fear Sasuke does take out Six Fast Naruto's ability to get. So Sasuke technically does counter Six Fast Naruto, but you need other stuff with your team. It's all complicated. We'll, we'll see. We'll see if this fear Sasuke is going to do enough to fight against Six Fast Naruto. Um, I'm leaning towards no, but I'm at like 30% sure. Okay, Wheel of Fortune, Ronin Zabuza. Let's talk about this, because this is one of the choices that we have. Um, that is actually really worth it this week. <sighs> I mean, this okay, in terms of value, Wheel of Fortune is, like, average, maybe slightly below average. Nah, probably just average. So, we don't want to go for average, but Ronin, Wandering Ronin Zabuza. Whatever they want to call it. Um, 
Let's go over their abilities real quick. So let's standard attack first. Attacks the lowest guy, decreases their defense by 10%. Kind of like uh, Seigetsu, but better. Um, fixed chance of low float and you ignore some defense. So it's like extra damage and stuff. His chase is low repulse two times, so it's nothing special. Um, so those two, you know, we'll get that out of the way. Now let's talk about the mystery, which is interrupt and remo irremovable blindness for one round, which seals, technically seals six fast Naruto, right? Um, and he steals all standard attacks off that unit. So if you use a whole bunch of mysteries and then you, st you hit six fast Naruto, then you're going to reduce somebody's defense by like four, 40% or something like that with your standard attack. Um, if the selected unit is an ally unit, oh, okay, so this is a double, double thing, uh, cause mist and cancel all buffs and shields to up to 12 units on both sides, except for water people, so, and this attack never misses, so, okay, it's kind of like Zabuza, okay, and what is mist, so let's, let's go over mist, um, let's see, on the, the fourth passive has a definition of mist, when a unit is suffering from mist, if the unit has a single target standard attack, they will attack a random unit. Could be an ally or opponent. So it's not exactly the best thing. It's worse than chaos. Um, and But it doesn't affect anyone who uh, doesn't have single standard attack, single target standard attacks. Six Pass Naruto is not affected by this because he hits three people. Kakazu is not affected by this because he hits three people. Kisame with breakthroughs isn't affected by this because he has uh, three people. Kashina is affected by this. Like, a, most, a lot of these ninjas, you know, don't, are not affected by this ability. So, you can counter some, but it's like, the ones that are counter would be like, Killer B. No, no, not Killer B. Edomina, Tokashina. I mean, uh, I don't know, man. It's, it's not that useful. It just isn't. I mean, it might be really useful for some stuff, but it's really not that... Single star. I mean, it's good for against support, maybe, if you're fighting against a fire main that uses sleep. But sleep has a chance to hit two people, right? So I don't even know if that works. I, I mean... what? Why is Mist so useless? Um, it can be useful, but it feels so useless. I mean, you guys tell me. I, mean, it's, it's, I don't know, man. Just... There's not a lot of units that do single target standard attacks anymore. And, you know, there's healing, there's shields, there's multi-hits. But most people don't hit one person. I mean, there's maybe Takasu Getsu, but that's about it, right? And it's, it, it affects, like, non-water people. It affects everybody, right? <sighs> okay, screw that. So far, not good. <laughs> and then the fifth passive. Let's see, he has super armor. Uh, you know, he can use two, two standard attacks each round. And then he has Bloodthirsty, so when his standard attack defeats somebody, he gets an extra standard attack. Yeah, don't get him. I, I just don't. I mean, he might be useful in some way or another if you have the money to spend him on, but that's really hard to use well, especially if he's affecting both sides. So, okay. Enough about Zabuza. I shouldn't have spent that much time on him. He was just interesting, but he just really isn't thing. Okay, the other thing is, yeah, the 10-point reward on Wheel of Fortune is good. Uh, Perfigation Pill, not so much. The other two is kind of worth it, okay? Um, 50 is worth more than the 100, but you can still do the 100. And then we have Susna Shisui, which seems to be going out of fashion. He lacks damage. Um, but he's able to stop people from using their mystery for a while, so... I mean, it, it kind of shuts down one part of 6 Pass Naruto, because 6 Pass Naruto gets his mystery back with the standard attack. But then he needs healing. Uh, his super armor is going to be suppressed by 6 fast Naruto, I guess. Depends on who's faster. I think it's also unmissable. So technically, you can suppress part of 6 fast Naruto with your with a, with a Susumu Shisui, but um, I think he requires too many things to fight against 6 fast Naruto to be an actual counter. But he's still good. You know, if you guys want him, go ahead. At least he's becoming free to play. We now we know he's becoming free to play when. He's not the best ninja out there. He can still fight against a whole bunch of ninjas. And I'm looking forward to maybe another ninja that can fight against Six Pass Naruto. And then we can use Susan and Shisui to counter that. And that'll be a rock, paper, scissors little thing. Okay, the second uh, uh, the second of the event that I think is possibly good to spend in his Lucky Wheels. And, of course, there's a Ten Tails Madara thing. Now, on this event, uh, I mean, this account, you guys know that I got uh, Ten Tails Madara for free for 80 fragments, I think. 
So I need another 100 fragments for that fourth. I'm not going to expect it, but it would be nice if I spun in Lucky Wheels and got it. You know, be kind of nice, right? Um, and then there's Taka Karen, um, which, you know, you probably expect a couple fragments of over a couple hundred draws. But um, she's good, I guess. But she's, she can still get killed and probably still need a revival ninja with her. So maybe a double healer team with her would be good. Um, be kind of interesting. Like each, whenever uh, someone uses their mystery, she gets a standard attack, which is healing. So that might be good with maybe Sage Kaputo. So like whenever you open it, uses a s s mystery attack. Everybody gets a whole bunch of mi uh, standard attacks. That would be kind of hilarious. Um, yeah, and then Tsunade would be nice too. Okay, in terms of the shop, Green Ninja Obito, I'm actually considering getting him just for kicks to see how good he is, honestly. Uh, but I don't know, man. Like, he seems okay, but it seems like, you know, if I if I can revive with Akasa Christian Kakuzu and then put six pass Naruto and then put Green Ninja Obito, I, I might try that. Because if I'm fighting a six pass Naruto team and I defeat the other side, then I use Green Ninja Obito to take out six pass Naruto. Does that mean I win? Like, if I fight a 6-pass Naruto, can't I just use this guy as long as he's alive? I take out the rest of the whatever, I mean, whoever's there, I'll just get rid of the back row with my 6-pass Naruto. And then use a Katsuki Christian Kakuzu to summon back Obito and remove my opponent's 6-pass Naruto. That means I win, right? Like, I really want to try that, so I might actually go for him, you know. That's just... I, I hope it works out. Because it's going to be hilarious to see this. This would be like the Hiruzen threat um, from before. The th third Hokage Hiruzen. It's going to be so good, man. Okay. Kono's Outlets. Uh, um, let's see. I'm going to do an experiment on Kono's Outlets. I have three accounts that I run just for coupons. And I'm going to get um, the maximum amount of cards possible for each day. And... Uh, so for seven days, I'm going to get three cards, I believe, because that's the maximum amount you can send to somebody. And then I'm going to use the three, those three accounts and send them to one of my main accounts. And let's see how many of this new refined optional packs we can get out of all these cards. All right. Um, hopefully, it's going to work well. The daily gift limit of three. So three accounts each day is nine cards a day times seven. Nine cards a day times seven is 63 cards. We're going to see how many... Um, epic refunds we can get out of six, uh, 63 cards. I guess that's going to be my little uh, <laughs> monthly project. It took quite a while to do this, so yeah, it's it's pretty costly. I don't recommend anyone else do it, but this would be fun. Okay, rec recruitment feedback, just do the 300. They're still doing under Hashirama, fine. Just do the 300. Uh, Jonin Metal Renewal, don't forget about that if you're Jonin people. And then Summon Rebates, do the 200. Not much else to say. Activity Loki Packs, just you know, collect it. I don't. I wish they had an auto collect. I don't want to collect 25 times for three accounts, but it is what it is. Uh, Naruto's Froggies from last week. So that is all the events. Now let's go over to my actual planned. Uh, I'm gonna head over and give me a second while I get my Discord running here. I'm gonna switch your switch you guys to the plan screen. Oh, you guys can't see it, huh? It's a little laggy. So I'm going to switch over to just the screen screen. Okay. So this is my plan. The double-triple spending plan. Uh, this is, oh, I'm making a reference to basketball. But the double-triple, hopefully I'm using it correctly. But we're having two 30,000 Fuku deals. That's basically what it is. Because this is a 60,000 coupon deal over two weeks. So that's a double-triple Fuku deals, right? Two 30,000 Fuku deals. Anyways. There are some possible routes that I identified. The main route is going to be 6-pass Naruto Break Me. So we're going to get it. Um, 6-pass, 100 fragments. I'm like 100 fragments. Let's see. I need 12 fragments. Okay. So I'm going to get 100 fragments from Fuku Deals. Uh, I think I forgot to mention that. But the packs give you 100 fragments of 6-pass Naruto or 80 fragments of Kakasu Christian Kakuzu. I'm going to get 6-pass because I already have Kakasu Christian Kakuzu. 100 fragments um, on the 30,000... Fuku mark, and I need 12 more fragments after that. So let me show you. Um, you know, I never actually had six pass Naruto. I have them on like accounts that are not mine that people let me use, but I've never actually owned six pass Naruto. So 
I'm like, what? Oh, I'm 16 fragments away, not 12. So that's going to be more than two or 3,000. I calculated this much on 12 fragments, but this is actually 16. So we're going to have to increase this to, I don't know, something like four, uh, 3,000 to like 2,000 to two, 3,000, something like that. Um, something like that. It doesn't matter. We're going to, we're going to do that first. And then we have like 27,000 more to spend on this week. Maybe a little bit more if I want to, because this is a 60,000 Fugu deal. So it's fine if we overspend a little bit. Um, yeah, but I do need advanced protection vials. I only have, let's see. Yeah, let's show it with uh, Sage mode. I only have 101 advanced protection vials. And to be safe, you need at least 200. But, you know, it's fine. You know, I might, like I had a little plan route. I could get all in on a powerful optional pack three, all 60,000 actually. Um, or actually not 60,000. If, if I max out the lucky wheel here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, if I max up the lucky wheel here, uh, because there's a there's a limit, so that would be forty eight thousand seven hundred two twenty seven coupons max. All right, to max out everything on there, and then I would have another twelve thousand for anything. Uh, I could do that route, but that feels a little bit boring for me. I want to try out new stuff. So, uh, and yeah, part of it's going to be advanced skill trap packs. So or. Great Ninja or Obito, with, uh, which costs this much according to the gaming community, whatever they posted. So it's going to be like 20,000 coupons, which is fine, because I need, only need 3,000 or so for 6 past Naruto breakthroughs. And then I'll have another 7,000 left over, maybe 8,000 hopefully, um, in which I have to get advanced skill trial packs. And, you know, I'll get some advanced skill trial packs, but I won't get too many. Like, I'll, I'll save up a little bit and then, like, switch... I'll get some six pass Naruto breakthroughs. Hopefully I get lucky and I don't actually have to spend a lot on skill trials, but I still need skill trials for, uh, if you guys remember from like one or two Fukus ago, I got Grey Ninja or Obito, uh, not Obito, Grey Ninja or uh, Madara. And he is still missing that standard attack. Now I was thinking about getting like a plus two on here and then a plus one on here, but I really need that standard attack, and honestly, I don't really care for the mystery too much. I mean, okay, maybe maybe I still need to, but I need more skill trials for this. It's I also or Great Ninja Moderate fragments. I I really can't tell which one I want because I do use Great Ninja or Madara in Great Ninja War, so you know it's I I'll just max him out. Yeah, it's probably better to just max him out. Hitting twelve people in, in Great Ninja War versus nine is actually pretty big deal because you deal a fair amount of damage um so i need a lot of skill trials and i'm hoping next week they're going to have more options for skill trials advanced skill trials or hopefully advanced protection files but man it's uh it's hard all right but yeah i'll get something like 72 if i spend the rest of uh so twenty thousand on obito another three thousand on six fast naruto and then another the rest is just, just going to be on uh lucky stars getting Advanced skill trial packs, which is a little bit of a waste, but I need it. Okay, sub route two. I, I thought about putting Ronin Zabuza, but after looking through it, no. <laughs> That's not going to happen. Um, I mean, you could. It's like 16000 to get the Susana Shisui reward, but yeah. I'm going to skip this part because it's. I realize it doesn't work. We could do both, but no. No Ronin Zabuza. Okay. Um, and, you know, I... I could spend another 30000 I thought, but I don't think there's anything else to spend it on. Um, I could Lucky Wheel, let's see, each day you can do 10000 so technically every single day you can max it out on Lucky Wheels. But if you do max it out on Lucky Wheels, remember there's a limit on the item that you're going to buy, so uh, that's going to be... Make sure to get, you know, you're going to have to get a ninja, not just power items. This is 40 something thousand. Um, if you're going to do another 20 something thousand, it has to be on a ninja, and then another ninja too. Unless you need a four-star ninja or something like that. Kimono Shusui is still pretty good. I don't know if he can counter success Naruto. It doesn't seem so. Um, but you can. we can try it sometime. Okay, so that is my plan. Um, I think I'm just going to go all in for Lucky Wheel. Except for the uh, six-pass Naruto breakthroughs. And yeah, we're going to do six-pass Naruto breakthroughs for number one. Uh, number two is going to be Lucky Wheel. Every day um, until 30,000 is hit. Uh, yeah, and, until we get Grand Ninja Obito. 
Um, maybe I should just not get powerful item optional pack three. No, no, no. It's Lucky Stars is still a good event because of all the training potions. And also, you know, a chance of Tentails and Madara. Who doesn't want that? Taka Karen is, is also fine to get extra fragments of. That might be something you do want to get eventually. She can be a pretty good combination. Uh, the only thing I don't like is her chase because it deals some damage. Hits two times, which you sometimes don't want. Uh, but other than that, the rest is pretty good. Okay, so that's my plan. Um, we're going to do... Uh, Fateful Choice to get to the number of fragments we need. We're going to do Lucky Stars. Then we're going to open Fuku Deals. Um, yeah, after three days because, you know, we have a limit on Lucky Stars. And then we're going to do Fuku Deals. Okay, that is my plan. All right, guys. Uh, I'm going to pause this. Now, for now, we're going to start a little double speed on the spending part. And then you guys will see. Um, keep, make sure to subscribe and... There is Kono's Outlets and an experiment on that, which I'm going to put in between the two Fuku deals. Um, and for the people who are waiting on the contest results, I've been busy. I'm going to get to it. Uh, we'll, I'll, I'll go over it, and I'm going to make sure it's done properly. Okay. All right, guys. See you guys in a couple seconds. You tell me you're not ready to love again even are you Yeah. 
Lost a few here, but it's not by choice, no This girl, I see your face every day when I look through my phone Can't delete all these memories, won't leave me alone Hit my blind side, never saw you coming You were so wild, but no, I was nothing And I'm nothing now, nothing's changed, you know I'm just the same Miss you now, but I hope that someday you explain I one last kiss at the right about My one last wish, you could never doubt You know we're living so free You and I when it's in me Making a vision a dream No one is getting to me Things time we set the flame Living like a renegade I swear we never get afraid that's real Okay now that's just who we are Been around the world so many times Seeing stars like Okay now that's just who we are Been around the world so now we going up to Mars like
distancing ourselves from the enemy Think we've got a method of a remedy It's hard at times But we'll make it We'll make it, yeah Traveling on our own down the boulevard Surrounded by shadows hiding in the dark It's hard at times But we'll fight it Yeah, we fight it, yeah We don't believe in what we started Don't believe in what we start